Hello, this is Clone Brother Reviews, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make some custom weapons. Let's get into the video. To start with the non-Star Wars stuff, here we have Doom Guy from the classic Doom series. The custom weapon here I have is the double barrel shotgun, and I'm just going to show you how you can make that right now. First, you're going to need the uh, old Western pistol piece. Then you're going to add on whatever this piece is. And finally, you add your binoculars into place like so. Overall, I think this uh, weapon looks quite good. And uh, let's move into the actual Star Wars stuff now. The first Star Wars gun I'm going to show you how to make is the EE3 from Boba Fett. Let's get into that. To start with, you're going to want a brown cone piece. You're then going to want to slot in this uh, piece. I don't know what it's called. Turning it sideways, you then put a fire hose piece on it, or at least that's what I think it is. And then finally you add your black candle piece onto the end of it. I think this works really well, and as the Book of Boba Fett series comes out, I'm sure it will be useful to a lot of other people as well. The next weapon I'm going to show you how to make is the Z6 Rotary Cannon. I don't know any of the piece names, but just uh, bear with me on this one. First we have this piece. Then we have a grey stick, not slid all the way through. Then you add two of whatever that piece is. And then you add a little cog onto the end. While I use this for clones, you could also use it for Star Wars Visions. Bear with me, 3PO is the closest droid I have. Next on the list we have the DC-15 Carbine. This is probably the easiest out of all of them, to be fair. You literally start with this gun piece, and then add a black candle piece onto the end of it. And there we go, that's all it takes to make a DC-15 carbine. To finish off the video, I'm going to show you my attempt to make the uh, DC-17M for the Clone Commandos. Start off, you have this uh, gun. You then clip onto the bottom of it, this piece. You then clip onto the side a hand. Then you get a stud with a hole in it and a stud without a hole in it. And just put it onto the end there like so. And as you've just seen, it works in black as well. Thank you for watching today's video. I've tried to up the quality a bit and I've removed the green screen as uh, things like Boba and the uh, Doom Guy would get uh, photoshopped out almost. If you very much like this video, then please subscribe as it gets me into the algorithm more, gets me recommended to more people. A like wouldn't do too much harm, however, I'm not as bothered by that as uh, I would be otherwise. Thank you for watching this video and uh, I'll see you again soon. Cheers.